Russia's combat unmanned ground vehicle, UGV, marker can reportedly operate autonomously for days and network with other UGVs and markers while sharing critical military data. Marker's artificially intelligence, AI, enabled system helps identify friendly vehicles and soldiers through camouflage patterns on their combat uniforms and insignia patches. These staggering capabilities were revealed in a German media report that interacted with the representatives of the private company that developed the UGV, touted as a leopard tank killer. And while the UGV's AI machine learning system is being updated with images and information on Western tanks to identify them, Russian soldiers on the front lines have undertaken exciting battlefield innovation and assembled their ground combat robot. Videos of this makeshift UGV, armed with a machine gun and a pair of rocket-propelled grenades RPG, externally, went around on various telegram groups. Appearing to be put together hastily, it still might have significant utility if used well against Ukrainian trenches, infantry, and built-up areas. The marker has been promoted especially as a first-of-its-kind tank killer after the US, Britain, and Germany announced sending their M1A2 Abrams, 31 units, Challenger 2, and Leopard 2, 14 each, main battle tanks to Ukraine in late January. The report on Anti-Spiegel said the marker can act independently even if radio traffic is disrupted, based on instructions by the operators on waypoints and patrol areas by independently recognizing and avoiding obstacles. This means the Russian developers have considered Western nations employing credible electronic warfare EW, and jamming to sever the connection between the marker and its operators. The robot can act alone but also in conjunction with other markers, which can share tasks. For example, one of which takes over reconnaissance and target search, while a second one remains hidden in the background until it attacks the recognized and marked targets, said the article. Whether this data linking too is controlled autonomously or has human interference is unknown, but if true, it represents a shockingly giant leap in artificial intelligence AI. Physical functions like autonomous travel, terrain negotiation, and weapons engagement upon identifying a friend or foe IFF, are still within the conceivable capability of an autonomous system governed by a highly advanced algorithm. The self-driving over terrain is achieved by a 360-degree field of view, with possibly various cameras and optics distributed around the UGV, not leaving any blind spot, according to the German report. Meanwhile, the IFF is an electronic catalog system with images of Western tanks in the regular and infrared format to identify the enemy equipment according to former Roscosmos chief Dmitry Rogozin. Possibly, an even more advanced version of software used for image referencing and facial recognition technologies must have been developed for the electronic catalog and then fused with the UGV's fire control system. But the talking feature described in the report, which implies that two markers can communicate between themselves and exchange complex and often contextual battlefield data, indicates a giant leap in AI technology and represents a niche capability.